this afternoon, fallout from last week's workplace attack and more. A local Muslim organization called CARE is now on the receiving end of belligerent, threatening phone calls. It's gotten so bad they have asked the FBI to step in. You'll recall Alton Nolan was arrested for murder following the slang inside Vaughn Foods. Nolan, a Muslim, had been trying to convert co-workers in the weeks before the attack. And although it appears race was more of a motive than religion, CARE is still being targeted. New at 4, we're hearing some of those graphic voicemails. News Channel Andrew Donnelly reports. I spoke with members of the Islamic Society of Greater Oklahoma City, and they tell me these messages scare them, and they've taken steps to ensure their safety. That woman did nothing to that guy. She did nothing to him. And you hide like cowards. I'm buying a Koran. I'm going to publicly on your no good religion. I think first thing that runs through your head when you hear something like that is, is shock, um, concern, and hope that, that um, nothing actually comes of it. Another voicemail was just as threatening, prompting CARE to contact the FBI. It, when you receive such a hateful call, you know, you get emotional. Um, and you get sad. In an email, one person wrote, wake up, get out of our state, get out of our country. Another said, your day is coming quickly where you will all be purged from my America. Tough messages for American born Adam Sultani and thousands of Muslims like him here in Oklahoma. He says these hate messages are targeting innocent peace loving Muslims for one extremist actions. This one man who committed this crime is, is truly a criminal and does not represent the 40,000 Muslims in Oklahoma. But the tormenting messages haven't broken him. Knowing that uh, Oklahomans show love during difficult times and that people within the faith community come to our support does make receiving these hateful calls a little bit easier. Andrew Donnelly, Oklahoma's News Channel 4. And on top of the threatening voicemails, CARE's also gearing up for that Muslim holiday. It begins this weekend. Coming up a little later, more on the extra precautions and security being brought in to keep thousands safe. In other